in cooperation with Cloister Cinema. This is Making Danish with Gordon. Let's get going! From the Pie and Pastry Bible by Rose Levy Barenbaum. So tell me what's in it again. How much flour? 300 grams of flour. How much yeast? A, t a, a teaspoon and a half of active dry or instant. Yeah. I use instant, but you know, it doesn't matter. And um, that's mixed. And then after you, uh, with your dough hook right. and your K5A, then you add uh, uh, your uh, cardamom, and I put in a generous amount. <laughs> <laughs> You know, most people will tell you a half a teaspoon or something. I probably put in a teaspoon and a half. I use a lot of cardamom. I like it. <laughs> and salt. And um, and then you add your salt, teaspoon and a half, and a tablespoon of softened butter, two thirds of a cup of milk. It should be weighed. I could tell you, but I don't remember. I don't do that. That's okay. And a table and a uh, egg. There we go. So you're going to put all this stuff in here. And, and that makes... makes you make a dough out of it. That makes the dough. The dough. So about so a tablespoon. tablespoon. Here's okay. what we're going to do. We're going to take this butter and cut it up into doodads. If somebody doesn't jab my arm with my sharp knife. I'm not jabbing your arm. I'm scared to death you will. <laughs> oh, and little pats. Well, it doesn't have to be in little pats if you can get it out in a nice... Fl Jesus Christ! That'd scare me to death. Passing by all the time. Well, you, you, you send out the orders and I'm trying to execute them. Kiss on the orders. Tell the general go to hell. I'll we got go other orders. This we I got think that's better. We got preceding, succeeding, DC, decreasing some kind of orders. Uh -huh. I guess this, this, I can't get plastic, it's tough. I guess they have it. I'm sure they have it somewhere. But this plastic wears out pretty easily. Somebody gave me this lever for many years ago. I think so. I kind of use it. That was a very good gift you gave me. He uses it. <laughs> This is the butter pat. Yeah, you pat the hell out of it. That's a butter, and that's a butter pat. <laughs> no, that, oh, a, is that a butter pat? No, that's a butter pat. You got confused. It's a you're butter pat. I see. You're confused. That's a butter pat. <laughs> oh, now, it's, is that similar to a pat of butter? No, 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 no. This is many pats. Oh, it's a patty of butter. Oh, you know patty. <laughs> Patty, I think. Well, I didn't know. I thought Patty was in New York. <laughs> no, Patty is in, in Cape Girardeau. Oh, <laughs> she's, Patty's not in New York. She's in John's. <laughs> Has to be cold. And what you want to finish up with, sad to say, is a five inch square of butter. Well, that's I nice. see. That's nice. After you've banged around on it and you got it all diddled and doddled about, that's what you gotta do. Finish up a five inch square of butter. And you're getting somewhere near it. You know, it's beginning to work, but you need to keep moving.
It gets. A, you have to have a lot of people cleaning the floor if you throw it all over the. I guess. I don't know. I hate to make too big a mess because usually I try to clean it up. Usually. Okay. Anyway, we got a little dough there. <coughs> I'm fall down thinking about it. Da -da 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 -da. A dough scraper. Oh, like so. Square that According to what she says, you want him to be about an eight inch square, isn't that? Oh. But don't give or take, you know. Not too bad an idea, I guess. Anyway, now you can get the butter. Okay. Out. You know, something like that. Oh, like a diamond. Something to that effect. We're going to toss the paper, and then we take a knife, and we mark it. Ta-da! 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 And that's what we do there. Let me mark it. And we're white off the knife's kind of fucked up for that. And then if you don't like to do that, let me take this off. Oh, I forgot I should have kept the paper and laid it on the... We gotta stretch these corners. Oh. Well, that's pretty snazzy. Stretch, boy. Stretch, stretch. Well, I wasn't too smart. Didn't do a good thing there. It wasn't a good thing. Go on out. Go on out. Way out. You get the stretch. It's going to have to. I think. I don't remember. And I usually read it, but you know, you don't want to do too accurate. Um, I think she usually. And thus, wow. Pinchy me. Pinchy, pinchy. Wow. And, thus, and we have it pretty well covered. Now, the wow. principle now is wow. to. Uh, Jigger this dude out to oh my gosh. Uh, a little length. Give it, begin to get a little length on it. So we're going to have to make a, a letter out of it. A letter. A uh, business letter. I see. Wow. One third, one third. And that's called fold number one? Yeah, that is the first fold. But I'm, unlike, <laughs> it's interesting she said, unlike, uh, oh, I keep forgetting that, which is nice, I like that sled. Um, unlike um, puff paste, where you just push a mark on it with your finger. Yeah. Because it isn't. It's this has got yeast in it. That won't mean anything. It'll be gone if you do that. So you have to mark it down somewhere or keep it in your brain. But you know, for three for three turns, how much you have to keep in your brain? I did <laughs> one. Only got what? two more. And in the refrigerator. This is turn number two. Uh huh. With the more flour. I have to get one of those magic rolling pins. Yeah. I guess I can do it with the wooden one. Oh, you do it with it. 
French dowel, I could do it. Yeah. To, Probably just as well, maybe better. The only reason for the marble is to keep it rather rather cold, cold. but you know, <laughs> in the length of time we're going to do this, probably isn't going to make that much difference. And this was in the refrigerator for about 30 minutes. Don't say about. Exactly. <laughs> 30 minutes. Well, that's good. <laughs> that's my best thing, yes. <laughs> Now, if you see flour on this thing, it's best to brush it off. What happens if you don't? Well, it doesn't, it doesn't adhere as well. I see. As you're splitting your layers, you know, yeah. you, you like to have it kind of stick better. Another business envelope fold. And back into the something to roll it a piece of plastic will work fine. Any old thing that just happens to turn up there, I guess. Turn up. Let and us back, back let she goes for how many more minutes? Let us turn up and pee. That's my vegetables for the day. Mm -hmm. uh, 30 minutes or 30 so. 30 minutes you know, or so. Keep it cold. It's still, you can tell by your hand, it's chilled boat, right? Okay, I plugged it in. Right. The proof box. The proof hey, box is yeah, you, really What did you do, Mother? It's a long time for. I brought the proof box It's a long time in. for. It's we ready. Need. It's, okay. It's not needed. So this is the last it's turn. Pretty, pretty homemade, anyway. Homemade yeah. proof box. Wow. Quite an operation. And there she blows. So if you were doing puff pastry, it's a whole lot more turns, right? Six. Six. Oh, not that many Six more. Six to seven. You get 1,900 layers. Whew, boy. It's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. And back in the refrigerator. Over that. <laughs> okay, what are we doing now? We're just gonna roll out the dough. We are rolling out the dough. Rolling? We're rolling. Rolling out the dough. The thing I think, the technique, I've never been able to perfect it, but Jock can do this so easily. I watch him do it. And so I try to do what he does, but of course I'm not capable of that. He's done it thousands of times. I might have done it a few times, very little. The uh, it's also known, and you know this, I think, uh, but it's, it doesn't hurt to accentuate the fact that rolling out a uh, dough of this sort, the uh, once folded, yeah. uh, well, it'd be mostly puff paste and that sort of thing. I think so that would apply, but. Uh, this sort of dough requires um, a 
requires trying to keep the corners reasonably even. And this is, I've seen them do this. I'm not as good at it, obviously. Looks pretty good to me. Well, what we're trying to achieve, you turn this over uh, once in a while because this side will roll out more than the other side. Right. Um, it's necessary to do something besides what you're doing. We have to get a one of those half sheets with the lid off of it and a half sheet of paper, and I only have one half sheet of paper ready. inches across here and each of those half inches will become a Danish someday oh my gosh if they grow up <laughs> if they grow up and if maybe they grow up and up and up it's on the up and up Now, if you will be so kind as... Yes. I kind of goofed that one, but you can kind of see it. Now, yep. here's what we're going to do. Okay. Now. We're going to cut this first line, and we're going to... Wow. Try to put it there, okay. First, it'll want to stick to me, but I'll quit that. All right. Voila. Now what we do with this, this will be a scrappy kind of piece. We do this. Oh, you roll it do this. like a twist. Yeah, twist the hell out of it. These are called twists, oh. Danish twists. That's what they're called. You stretch them, roll them, stretch them, roll them, stretch them. Oh, wow. Em. And so that's what makes the thing. And you just roll them up like that, like a this pinwheel? One. Yes. And, and that's it. a Danish? And that's it. That's a Danish. <gasps> and it and lop, tuck lop, it under. Lop, 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 lop. Set it on here. Okay. Voila. We have about eight. No, we don't have eighteen, do we? I don't remember. Well, I don't whatever, know. whatever comes out. <laughs> Just do whatever how many I got. These will become better as they're thick as, as you know squares. Right. That first one is always kind of not not perfect by any means. Stretching, stretching, stretching. That's good. Now, is she rolling. doing it right? Hold the end. No, no. Well, you're going backwards. I'm going backwards. I, I, it'll probably work, but it's going <laughs> to unwind. It's going to be a backward one. It's it, backward. It'll, it'll have a different. Coming to the proof She'll box. Get we'll get him in a minute. This is the proofing room. The problem with this is you can't turn it over here. You have to lift it off. But you don't care about that. You put it on the end, Gordon. See, I used to throw it up. Here, you want me to hold it? No, no, no. I guess somebody better here. hold it. I can't. I can't get it in okay. this way. You don't need pictures of everything. Oh, I do. No, you don't. Here. Yeah. 
Here okay, they come. Out of the fancy proof no, no, box. No, 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 right here. You want them both here? I want them both here. This thing you set over somewhere else. And take these. See these, it's very important. Look how they, how nicely they rise. Oh my when they gosh, have a chance. look at them. They look like they, I think they've risen perfectly. Yeah, they go Ooh, they far. smell really good. They go good. too far and you're big, you've got big trouble. It's the same as if they don't go long enough. It's ridiculous. I never So know. what happens when they go too far? It'll, it'll uh, not bake right. They'll, over, they'll leak too much stuff. They leak anyway. Yeah. If they go too far, they'll leak all their butter. If they go too short, they won't be uh, crisp and puffy inside and nice. And it's, it's a very delicate thing. you got to two times, two times the size. I never know two times the size, for sure, but what else do you know well, in this world, for sure? Well, we used to always get in too big a hurry to bake. Yeah, I've had that happen, too. And uh, the like last that. time he made them, they were perfect, but... Well, this is going to be perfect, too. Well, I wouldn't say that. These are looking a little puffier than I think they ought to be. Uh, let's see. Honey and mm -hmm. right, the honey and it's called honey stung cream cheese. Honey stung cream cheese. That's what she calls it. She has a good name for everything. And that's what goes in the center of a Danish. Oh, not exactly. It goes around the edge, huh? Where's the lek bar? Homemade because paprika homemade. weiss it is, is closed. Homemade. That is true. Paprika weiss is no more. Lek bar by the barrel. But I wouldn't need a barrel anyway. <laughs> this little jar's killed me in for a couple of three times. This may be the third time I've used it. I don't know. And this is, where are these cherries from? Michigan. Michigan cherries. American Spoon. American Spoon. They have them all ready to go. Nice Michigan cherries. I love the honey. Oh, that's so good, isn't it? Honey stung cream cheese. I get too much juice now. I'm getting too juicy. I'll save some for you, but That's okay, I had some. <laughs> I may eat some more of it. You help yourself. Uh -huh. Okay, going into the oven. Okay. One. Going into the oven. Two. What about the other one? Get it on the top layer. <laughs> Going into the oven. Three. Okay. Let her rip. Turn right, the oven 70. down to 375. Set the timer. I forget how much I want. Ten minutes. Here they come. Oh, they look really good.
pretty good to me. Looks like. It looks like. Come on, Harry. Damn it. They're crisp enough out there. They are. Wow. Yeah, I had to learn to make these because I can't eat Danish anywhere else. They're horrible. I thought I'd give you a lesson just before I die. Yeah. <laughs> Dear, I just, I'm older than I look, you know. I <laughs> just have to make this up for you just before I go. My last parting words to you, my dear. Oh, <laughs> Enjoy your day, Nisho. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. I forgot to do my yoga. Oh, God. <laughs> You got another half sheet to do. You can't d drop over Leave yet. Leave some in the freezer before you go. <laughs> no, <laughs> right, hey, right. Hey, that's a good idea. For the wake. Yeah, <laughs> that's it. We you can't eat those. Those are for the wake. <laughs> you heist a little, little champagne with a, with a little oh. Danish. Now, there's a combination. I'm going to have to make more of this shit, I bet you. I'm just sure. I always do. So blow it every time. You want to get it on while they're hot, hot, hot? It's to go. Hot, 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 hot. So how's that Danish, Mother? That's really good. Let's see where it is before it's gone. <gasps> there it is. That's cherry. That's cherry Danish. And this is apricot. Lekvar Danish. And there's the Danish maker. And there's the Danish maker. Turn around. Hello, Danish maker. Hello. Danish maker, one more time. Walter. Walter wants whichever one you don't want. Well, he's going to get an apricot black bar. There you go. That sounds perfect.